Hey everybody and welcome back finally to another episode of Terra Firma Craft Plus. Woohoo! So this episode, um, I was requested that people would like to see me build something, so I come up with a build I'd like to do. Um, I thought it'd be really cool to build a pub slash brewery where I could go and obviously make my alcohol, wines, and beers, and whatever. Anything alcoholic we're gonna make there. But before we do that, um, I just wanted to share here this, uh, nice basalt brick floor. I think it was basalt, right? Yeah, I found some basalt. Where was it? It was like, I gotta look at my maps here. It's been a while. Oh, I guess my maps didn't say, but trust me. I went like all the way out over here somewhere. Yeah, over, over here. It was like over here. Found a bunch of basalt out here, so I went out there and got some. I'm gonna probably have to go out and get some more. But yeah, I got this nice basalt brick floor here, and I quite like it. But, so the things I'm gonna be needing to do here. So I'm gonna be needing to get some uh, red brick, some clay. Oh, look at that. It's raining here for once. Woo! But I'm gonna need to make a lot of red brick here, because um, the building... And building has a lot of bread brick. I'm basing it off in the actual building, so I find that just fun to do. So I need a lot of uh, the uh, red brick, so I'm gonna make have to make a lot of this stuff. And I want to also use that uh, like that that mud block that requires you having to use like the waddle as support. Yeah, waddle and dab. I think that's how you pronounce it. But yeah, I want to make the base. Out of this and then the upper bits with the stone brick or with the uh, red brick. Sorry. So let's start doing this right here Boom look at that. We got all that clay bricks there. I'm gonna collect some more uh, I'm gonna go ahead and collect some more clay here so we can get some more bricks and such and I'm probably gonna need more sticks for these this waddle and uh, dab thing, dab, or whatever it's called. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and collect a bunch of these resources, and then once I get a bunch of these resources here, I think we're gonna have to find a nice spot for one, or to build it. I was thinking maybe, eat, like, over here, probably, like, right over here, we'll, so we'll chop down this tree over here. I wanna keep that one, though. I like that tree. But yeah, I like to put it, like, right over here somewhere. I think this would be a really good spot for it right here, right next to the barn and such, and the animals. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and grab some resources, and I'll meet you back here. With hopefully enough resources to start building this, uh, this pub here. Alright, I gotta make mud, and it's been a while since I've made mud, so let's see if this works. So, apparently I'm supposed to do this. Oh, wow, look at that, I actually did it right the first time. Look at me go! I feel like we've got a decent amount of stuff here. The only thing I needed to do here was make the actual uh, bricks here. Or else he gives. Oh, that gives us 48. That's not bad. I got some more being baked as you just saw. So let's go. We will be probably good to go here for this. But all right. Um, I actually was told by one of my viewers that he noticed something interesting, or they noticed something interesting when once I made the uh, last episode. I made this brass compass and. It indicates you in the top left of what region you are in. and apparently I'm right on the border of Europe and America See like I'm in Europe over here if I go over here. I'm in the Americas So that's something that's very interesting. I've never noticed but yeah, it looks like I'm in, in America and Europe Which is very interesting here, but all right, we've got some of the materials we need here to start building <clears throat> and I guess it's start it's time to start building this thing so Okay, so let's get started with the build here. So the base of this thing it's gonna be like I said made of the daub here the mud and daub or whatever the waddle and daub sorry So we're gonna want to have the entrance facing this way of course So this thing is gonna be I don't it's probably gonna be decently sized decently sized building here, but I think we're gonna want the uh, entrance to be like <clears throat> Let's have one edge be here. So we'll have one entrance here and then look at that. Oh look at that That looks very nice. Look at that nice block right there. Very nice 
And then we're going to have it stick out a block. Actually, mm, we want one like that. Actually, no, that's actually fine. Okay, well, then we'll have it stick out one like mm. this. So we have like a little, I guess like a little window thing right there. So this will be three blocks, like so. And then uh, we'll have, can I, Mark, can I chisel down these uh, blocks? Mm. Actually, I'm curious. No, I cannot. I, I can. Oh, I cannot. Uh, no, I can't do that either. Okay, I, f I figured I wasn't able to do that, but okay, that's. I guess that's okay. All right, decided we're not gonna have the block stick out. I think what we're gonna do here is we're gonna put these out of the way because I'm gonna need my pickaxe. Obviously, we're gonna have a three block gap here of wood. So let's cut some of this hickory wood up and make some blocks. We'll put one, two, three blocks there. And then we'll have one here with a gap of two, I think, for the door. Oh, and of course, this chest is in the way now. So then we'll put another one here. Let's move this chest out of the way. Oh, do I? Can I pick up the chest, please? All right, got that out of the way. So we got that. Here we need two more uh, hickory logs here. So I think I have some more over here. That's oak. Yeah, there we go. We got some hickory right here. Let's just cut this up real quick and make it into more planks. Oh, do I really have to do that again? Oh no, I need to do that. And move the chest again. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna cut and I'll be right back. All right, rise and shine. It's now a new day as well. All right, so we'll put the next corner right here. There we go. I'm like, why can't I place a block? Okay, perfect. Now we got that. And then I gotta look at my image here again. Mm. All right, and then it actually sticks out a little bit here. So I think what we'll do here is maybe we'll do a little bit of, we'll put some uh, hickory or chestnut. Yeah, hickory right here. So one, two, three, and then we'll chisel this, mm. this bit. So we get like a smooth like corner going on right here. Um, let's see if we can change this. Yeah, there we go. We got a nice like, little corner edge thing going on right there I don't know why I put that block right there I think we'll take that out and then and then okay then we'll put another daub a waddle and daub right here boom yep that looks good and I think what we'll do here is probably we'll put probably put like a wind actually you know what let's not do this uh, maybe we'll make this out of some other uh, it's like beta man like it's a stone block <laughs> I think what we'll do here is actually we'll put we'll put hickory right there again. An interesting tip right here. You can use a sword to break down the leaves on the ground quicker. This is going to be quite a big building, which I'm fine with because I think we're going to be making a lot of alcohol and things. And I actually want to make this. This is going to be a two-story building, right? So I want the top the top story to be actually where my bedroom is going to be. This will be the third time I've moved my bedroom, which is kind of funny. Um, but I think we're gonna do we're gonna have like a little like edge thing maybe we we'll take out one of these blocks under here, but we'll do that later. Um, so we'll put the rest of the, the wall. We'll just mimic that other side over here now. All right, there we go. We got the basic layout of the of the the size of this thing. So now we're gonna have to build up the walls here a little bit. So now I think we're gonna have these up two more blocks here. All right, perfect. Yeah, I like that. So we'll have that. The base here will be three blocks high on all the sides here. So I'll do go ahead and do this real quick. And I don't think we'll need... Uh, we won't have any chestnut on this next row. And actually, let's see. If we... No, if we do a glass panes, a, the pane... I don't actually... How will the glass panes... Do I have any glass panes? I'd like to test this out real quick to see how this will go. All right, sadly, I don't have any more glass panes, so I won't be able to test this out or, uh, to see if this, if the glass pane would be like on, on the edge of the inner part of the uh, slab or the block there. That kind of sucks, but oh well. I'll have to make some more. I'll make that off camera, in between episodes, I guess. We'll put one more here because we're gonna have a glass window right here. We'll have glass, and then maybe we'll have another. I like it like a lighter green color actually. If there's like another green color of wood yeah if we get something like this maybe or like oh man i need to try to find aspen and birch i love these colors these are 
beautiful colors. I need to try to find some of those. So maybe off camera I'll also try to find some aspen and birch trees. Because I love the color of those trees. They look really pretty. Alright, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and cut here. I'm gonna just uh build up all these walls up here, the the waddle and daub bits up to the three blocks tall. And then we'll try to see if we can get this whole first floor, like the floor, or at least the first story done here in the next episode. Or maybe we'll finish the second the first story here and then start laying out the red brick on the top so we can get an idea of how it's gonna look. Because I think this is going to look pretty cool. But yeah, I'm going to do this and I'll be back with you once I finish this. Okay, so I've been wandering because so I've been really wanting to try to find some uh, of the Aspen and Birch uh, planks. Because I just, I really, really want them, honestly. And I stumbled upon a mangrove, uh, what biome is it actually called? I didn't even actually check it out. Uh, I can't see the biome name, but I found a biome with the mangrove trees and they look so awesome. And look at that. There's fish here. There's bass in the water. So I need them. I didn't have an, I haven't marked down this place yet. So we need to mark down this place. And I need to add fish so we can come back here and make a fishing shack. And maybe go do some uh, fishing here, man. This is freaking epic. Oh, yeah, by the way, look at the mangrove um, wood. It looks gorgeous. So I'm actually going to chop down one of these guys and see if I can get... Can I get a sapling from one of these things? A uh, mangrove. I can. Okay, so we're going to try to get a sapling from... Oh, I got a sapling. Well, I'll get at least two or three of these saplings. Because um, these trees look absolutely gorgeous. And I love the, the roots. Oh, and there's actually there's, there's some more over here. Um, but yeah, look at these trees are freaking gorgeous looking. This thing, this biome looks so cool. And I think I'm still in Europe. I mean, no, oh no, I'm in the Americas now. Look at that. All right. So I'm going to collect some of this wood and get some more saplings from this tree here. And then hopefully uh, when I meet back up with you, uh, we can find some aspen and birch trees because I really want that wood. And then we'll have to come back here and do some fishing because look at all these fish in here. I don't even think I've made a fishing pole yet. So we'll make like a fishing like shack thing over here so we can do some fishing. Same thing. That would be really cool to do. I just had to share what it looks like when you actually chop down one of these trees. So you chop the bottom first and then it just leaves the roots here. And you can't actually chop down the roots. So that's very interesting. I'll show it one more time. So you just chop the bottom here, and then just the roots uh, stay put. So I, I wonder if that means if the tree will actually, like, regrow from this stage. But yeah, I thought that was very fascinating. I'm not used to the swimming in this. It's really weird. Alright, I just found a really another really cool, interesting tree. This, I don't know how to pronounce it, but it's like a, it's a, it's a light, it's like a light blue color. It's called a Maho tree. Uh, I think that wood color is absolutely beautiful as well. And I forgot how many blocks we are from the fish. Yeah, about 600 blocks away from there. So not that far of a walk, but enough to find another cool tree here. And I don't know if, where we are. We're still in the Americas. Okay. So I got to try to get a couple of saplings from this tree too, because... This tree, I love this wood color. This wood color is really cool looking. Alright, we got a sapling. And the sapling looks really cool as well. I'm going to try to get another one at least so I can get uh, two more of these guys. Or at least one more of these uh, saplings hopefully. And there's another tree over there. So I might get another sapling over there if I need one. And I, don't, I think this is jungle. Let's just chop this down and see what it is real quick. I was not expecting to go on a tree wood hunt tonight, or today. Uh, K-Poc. Uh, where is, is it gonna be? Oh, it's purple. I'm not really a big fan of that one, but I guess we have that. Oh! Oh, that's the same sapling. That was a new sapling. I'm like, oh, another sapling of, the tr of this tree, but nope, it's not. Alright guys, I am back at the base. Um, I figure I'd just do a bit more exploring off camera because I didn't want the video to get too long. Obviously, I think it's getting long enough already. Um, I was hope I was worrying that it wasn't going to be long enough, but I think it's a perfect amount. I think it's long enough now, but yeah. Um, I ended up finding, what was it? I think it was the birch. Yeah, I found the birch trees 
Um, I didn't end up finding the the aspen, but it's all right. I kind of want to use the birch, anyways. But I, I'm definitely gonna go try to find some more aspen sometime in the future. Oh yeah, I also found some willow, uh, willow trees. So I just took some of the saplings. So I ran, I was running out of space in my inventory, and I didn't really want to empty out any more of my items in my inventory. Um, but yeah, I got some willow trees. I I already planted all the birch trees over here, and also the uh. The Namaho trees, the blue wood. So that's really cool. Um, I'm going to sleep away the night here real quick. Um, but yeah, as soon as it's morning, I'm going to replace these chestnuts with some birch logs here. Hopefully I have enough for that. And yeah, we'll work from there and try to get this first level done. Uh, and then in the next episode, we'll start, uh, hopefully try to complete the building next episode. All right, I don't think we're going to be able to get this fish floor, first floor finished here because I need to get the glass, and I haven't need, made the glass yet, so I'll do that off, off after the episode too. But let's at, least, let's at least put some of the doors in here, shall we? And I think I'd like to have the trim be that maho, that blue color. I think that'd be kind of nice. And I got to say, this the birch color goes beautifully with the, uh, the daub. The waddle and daub. It looks so good together, I think. And also, in the future, I think I like to make the, the whole floor here out of this red brick here. I think it just looks fantastic. Look at that. It looks beautiful. I'm, I've always been a huge fan, even in vanilla Minecraft, of the red brick. I love the red brick. So we're going to put this here and all this for the door entrances here. And then, of course, we will... Let's add in the door right here. Look at that! That looks fantastic! Beautiful colors right there. Let's get some of this stuff going on. Let's cut some of this out. I love that color. It looks so nice. I like to have this as part of the, of the like, the trim up here. Um, can I, like, can I get a good angle right here? Look at that. That looks great! Is there, like, a darker blue? There's not a darker blue, but that looks great enough. I like that already. Yeah. And maybe we'll put like a sign above one of these too eventually. But right now I'm gonna put down some of this uh, railing on the on like the whole thing here. So I love this color. But before I do that, I need to figure out what color I want to put up here. Try, maybe maybe put chestnut here. Yeah. Does that look good or is that is that too much? Is this too much? Or should I just go with uh, more birch on the top? Like this. I don't know. You guys let me know. Should the top trim here be the chestnut? Or should it just be the birch? Because for sure, I want to have the the rim here of the uh, top of the first level uh, to be with this maho blue. I love this blue color. I think that looks really nice. Very, very sweet indeed. But yeah, uh, I think honestly we should end the episode here. Actually, no. Before we do that, let's just put... And where the uh, bricks are going to be here. The brick, the second level of the bricks. Um, and I think before I, uh, when, when I finish recording here, I'll probably start putting in the, in the, all the doors here. But yeah, let's put some of the brick in here so we see how this looks at least. So all this is going to be brick for three, the three levels here like that. Let's just put in this whole like first row in here with brick so we can get this good look at what this is gonna look like here um and then we'll have like some railings or not railings but like we'll have windows here so we'll have no window right there so two block in then we'll have a three block wide window maybe yeah right above right above the uh this bit right there i, I kind of i like that and then we'll have a two block wide window there and then three there. I like that. Let's see how this looks from over here in the front. Ooh. I wish there was a darker blue. Not gonna lie. I wish there was a darker blue. Or maybe, oh, maybe when we get the willow trees, maybe we can replace this trim with some uh, willow. I think, ah, yeah, I think that, even, that actually might look better, having the willow planks be the trim i think yeah that would look way better i think but yeah um i think this is a great start to this pub here we got a good idea of what we want to go here or build here but yeah i hope you've all enjoyed this episode because i actually had a lot of fun doing this and again i always apologize that uh it's like months 
that takes me months to come out with these videos, but I'm just so busy with school and such. I wish I had time to do these episodes more often because I really enjoy this series and recording these videos for you guys. And it seems like you, you guys love watching these videos too. But uh, let me know what you thought of the episode. You want to see me continue building on this building. Tell me if you like the, the chestnut or the birch on the top. Um, but yeah, uh, thanks for watching this episode, everybody, and I will see you in the next one, everybody. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.